What's going on everybody? Welcome to Tech Reacts where every beat counts. My name is Matt Tech. Thank you so much for joining me today. And thank you to everybody who joined the channel via the first Sabaton reaction that we did, the Bismarck. Uh, thank you as well for filling me in on what Sabaton does. I got pretty engrossed on their website the last couple of weeks that I've been traveling to learn just like random historical facts. So while I am a history nerd, I don't know everything about history. I, what I mean by history nerd is I love learning about history. So uh, the fact that I didn't know, I mean, like I know what the Battle of Atlantic is, but I didn't know the Bismarck. To, anyway, some of you guys take this a little bit too serious. But for the rest of you, thanks for taking time to educate from a loving position. Uh, overwhelmingly, Y'all had said that Christmas truce needs to be next. Now, I, I I believe I know the story on this one. I believe that this was the First World War. And um, the, the, the two sides, I forget who it was. See, still learning. Don't know all the facts of everything. But whoever was fighting on the Western Front, they, they called a truce on Christmas and celebrated Christmas together, then went back to fighting. That's my understanding of it. But uh, I'm really, really anxious to get into this one. Sabaton Christmas Truce. Before we do, come hang out with us on Discord. We're having a great time. Consider supporting the channel. Buy me a coffee, Patreon, lots of extra goodies there. We also have a new partner on this journey. We have partnered with wait for it, a diaper company. Uh, they are Every Life Diapers, great quality diapers and wipes, um, affordable, you can get it on a subscription, values-based as well. So they are, so uh, Every Life is the only pro-life diaper company, which is really important to my wife and I. If that's important to you, I would highly encourage you to grab your diapers through them if you're in need of some. We thought our diaper changing days were over giving that we have a 12 and an eight year old until last year when the Lord blessed us with a, a new baby. So we've been changing diapers like crazy and the every life diapers have been just phenomenal. If you use the code Matt 10 on the website, that gets you 10% off the first order. It also lets them know that I sent you. So here we go. This is Sabaton Christmas Truce and it's, oh, it starts off Western Front 1914. Here we go. quality video production. That's a play on Carol of the Bells. Dun da dee dun dun da dee dun dun da dee dun dun da dee dun. They're just changing. They're changing the motive there. That's really neat. Yeah. That beginning is very reminiscent of Trans Siberian Orchestra. As a avid TSO fan and somebody who performed professionally in a tribute to Trans Siberian Orchestra production for over a decade, um, uh, the Christmas and the rock aspect here is very just it tugs at my heartstrings. Super 
silence. Oh, I remember the silence on a cold winter day. After many months on the battlefield, and we were used to the violence. Then all the cannons went silent, and the snow fell. Voices sang to me from no man's land. I'm absolutely, 100%, absolutely loving this, and I'm gonna I'm gonna let the video finish, but I'm gonna tell you why, especially in this moment, why I'm very much enjoying this. But I wanna I wanna get to this. We have a lot of song left. This is a great story to tell.
So it goes through the credits. Um, I, I'm not sure I know what, what the significance of the, the 2021 portion is on, on the cross, but let me tell you what I was thinking about. As I, as I record this, it is July 16th, and just, just a few days ago, the entire world witnessed an assassination attempt on a former United States president, Donald Trump. And now look, regardless of how you feel about Trump or whatever political party you decide to align yourself with, that, that kind of behavior is just not, that is not who we are as a nation. What what's very interesting about this is when the is when the British and the Germans come together for a day and then immediately had to turn around the next day and start killing each other again. It it's perfectly indicative of kind of what's going on, at least in our country here in the USA, and probably more broadly seeing what's going on in the world, that we are fighting each other over ideas. But in recent years, we've began to fight individuals based on those ideas. What the Christmas True Story tells me is that you can fight for an idea that you believe in without necessarily hating the person in front of you. Because when they were together, it says it says that, you know, that tonight we are friends. But when you, so when you're up close and personal with an individual, it's a different perspective because you're seeing them as a person when you pull back, back to your respective sides, now you're seeing the idea and that's what you're fighting against or fighting for on your side. Um, I brought up, I brought up trans Siberian Orchestra one, cause it was very sonically, uh, close, but there's also a song on Christmas Eve and other stories called old city bar. And it's a it's a fabulous tune. If you've ever seen them play this live, it is just an acoustic guitar and a vocalist, but the vocalist is dressed as a homeless man. There's one part in the there's one part in the song where he says, "If you want to arrange it, this world you can change it. If we could somehow." make this Christmas thing last by helping a neighbor or even a stranger and to know who he, who, and to know who needs help, you need only just ask. So when I was performing with these guys, uh, that was my favorite song of the night. Not because it's the one song I got to sit down and not play and get a rest in, <laughs> amongst the sea of instrumental muscle that goes on in that show. But because at the end of the day, that that song completely encapsulates the story arc that that album is trying to tell, which is overall what Christmas means to Christians is the hope, the hope of the world uh, coming and arriving and how we can be that hope for other people, how we can, how we can take the spirit of what Christmas represents and carry that over into every single day. And that song says it, if we could somehow make this Christmas thing last, because here in the U S Christmas is a time where people become incredibly selfless and giving. And then the holidays are over and we're back to being our own, uh, our own kind of selfish selves. But if we could somehow make this Christmas thing last, if we could somehow make this Christmas truce last, the world would be a better place. And I don't have the solution for it. I just know that what's going on in our world right now is not the answer. Uh, so that was a little heavy. I, I appreciate you guys sticking with me. Thank you for the recommendation. I want to keep going down the, the Sabaton uh, journey. So what's next? Let me know what the next song is. Trusting you guys in this journey. 
Take care of yourselves. Join us on the Discord. Check out Every Life if you're in need of some good quality diapers. Matt 10 for 10% off. And we'll see you guys on the next video. Take care.